welcome uh, the first group to the stage, uh, Team Active. Hello, um, good afternoon. My name is Carlos Luna. Hi, my name is Karina Mojica. And the rest of our group is um, Amber Fang, Roman Puxer, and Shakira Grant. And our mentors are Catherine Langman and Bupesh Mishra. And we are team actors. So we decided to take on the issue of obesity among, uh, among young. Um, it is a major health problem across the nation, uh, in which it will be uh, it's a factor of other major health issues, such as heart disease, diabetes, high blood pressure. And the children are not aware of a healthy lifestyle. They're not aware of proper, a proper diet and a proper exercise. So we partner with Valentine Boys and Girls Club in Bridgeport, and we work with a group of children, um, third and fourth graders. And we did this um, almost every Friday, um, uh, starting on October until the end of the, our OGP, which was March. Our goals of the program were to introduce healthier living habits among children and so they can impact others around them or like spread the word to their friends or family and they can just create a healthier lifestyle for people in their lives as well. Activities we did consisted of a food pyramid where we had the children cut out pieces of food and they placed it in the right um, food group in the pyramid. And we also did fruit cutouts where the students cut out fruits and they wrote facts about the fruits and ways that it can, it can impact their health and ways that it can help them. And we also had a Frisbee day where we gave all the children Frisbees from IIT and they really enjoyed playing with them. It was a fun activity. And we also had active days where we played a lot of games like basketball, birthday tag, the kids really loved that game, kickball, and we did other physical activities. We also awarded the children with prizes based on their good behavior and way they wanted to involve in the activity. It was really good. So we had a lot of problems and issues, but the most, well, the major problem that we had was basically just capturing their attention because you know when we're children, everyone doesn't like to like pay attention to the adults and they like to run all over the place. <laughs> so we had to find um, activities that were fun, but also taught them what um, the importance of healthy living. So that was one of our biggest issues to um, transfer the importance of healthy living. And that was like hard as well because some children were just, they just didn't want to pay attention to us and they just ran all over the place and ran away from us. <laughs> We had a lot of accomplishments because in the beginning we had a, made a survey where we had them write down the things they knew about like healthy living and we also, but towards the end, we, all, we also had them do another survey where we were able to see how they grew um, upon knowing what healthy living was, like their exercising and how <coughs> to eat healthily. And so we also were able to accomplish how to successfully run a program because it's not easy having to make all these lessons up and have um, everyone show up on time. And by this, we were able to um, improve our leadership roles because in the beginning we had an adult supervise us, but towards the end, everyone started believing us more and we were the ones who were running this. It was just us. So towards the end, we, we were able to improve our leadership roles and we were able to also have a lot of takeaways, both ourselves and the children. So we were able to learn alongside them as we taught them. Oh, and we also did the program. We, it impacted us as well. It encouraged us to eat healthy and exercise more. Yeah. 